I was just about to run to the roof when my savior and friend, the man whose unborn child I had just killed for, decided to leave without me. just flew off on me. After everything we've been through, I, I saved his girlfriend's life. Who? Raul Passos? Yeah, Raul Passos. Yeah, I don't. I thought you guys were very close. We were. Well, you know what? I did a background check. Jesus. I mean, I thought the two of you worked for Rodrigo Branco. Yeah, so? So? Did you get paid by Victor? Victor? No. Well, Raul Passos did. Six times. Dating back to a few months before you turned up. He even paid for a ticket for him to go to New York. Why? I don't know. My guess is to meet you. But why? I don't know. Maybe he liked you. Maybe he thought you needed a break. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe he wanted some dumb gringo to come down here to shoot things up and maybe to take the watch for Rodrigo when he got shot. I don't believe that. Why? Because you're not a dumb gringo? Or because you are? You know, I have no fucking clue anymore. Okay, let me ask you something. What? Well, what is it that you really thought that you were doing down there in Panama? Hmm? And don't tell me you're so naive as to think you were just down there guarding a woman. I didn't know what to say. I had been so loaded in Panama, I could scarcely remember my own name. I know things that got real heavy. Panama had been my second job with Passos. The first had been easy. Money for banging waitresses at some fancy wedding in the Caribbean. This seemed like another easy gig. It was the middle of the day, and like any self-respecting idiot, I was half cut. No, Nothing like doing some good blows, some good friends on a boat. Nasty! I love this one! Marcello, you're going to be the death of me! Sure beats New Jersey, huh, Max? Some ways. Hey, come on, it's awesome! Drunk and tan, listening to house music. Most of them have plastic surgery and they're all doing blow. I guess it is kind of like Jersey, huh? Oh. oh I gotta quit drinking so much. I give myself serious liver damage. Big deal. You can always get a new one. Relax. I hope you're not drinking on the job, gentlemen. <laughs> Kidding, I hope you are! <laughs> Just stay off the air, hmm? I don't have enough to share. I'm kidding again! <laughs> oh, Mikey. Even though we just met, I feel like we are good friends, you know? Mm. I feel like safe with you guys. Know that. Real safe. That's great. And I love New York. Uh, the East Hamptons. Do you know it? Uh, not really. I, I spent my honeymoon in Montauk. Oh, where's that? It's just down the road. Whatever. Last time I was there, I got so wasted, I nearly shit myself. <laughs> I didn't know you were married. Yeah, well, my wife passed away. Good. Not good. Bad. Real bad. But good, because now I can get you laid a lot. <laughs> it is great to be single, hey? Uh, I love a woman. She's with another and she doesn't want to know it. Fuck her. Let me 
Could you believe that shit? Okay. Excuse me, I'm going to uh, go to speak to Felipe. Felipe! You crazy crackhead! Lay off the yayo, hey! Pasos. Walk with me. Yeah. What's the deal with this guy, eh? He's kind of... Back up. He's a good guy. Yeah, sure, ta bon, ta bon. But have him smile a bit more, you know? Because life, life is good! <laughs> ah. Where's the truck? It's coming. Hey, soon. Pasos. I gotta go my down. Okay. Dead guys looked like soldiers in one of those Central American guerrilla armies. Pirates with a manifesto. Psychos with a dream. That sort of bullshit. The radio. Maybe I could send out an SOS.
manos a la cubierta inferior. Vete a ver qué pasa. Asegúrate de que los burros no derrochen municiones sí. con los tripulantes. Todos hey, los demás hey, siguen buscando. ¿Qué pasa? It certainly wasn't the first time I'd woken up with a hangover, long after a party had turned sour. The need to get out of the boat's hull and onto the upper deck as soon as possible was countered by the probability of running into another hijacker. I had to move carefully. The second I got out of there, I needed one more gulp of fresh air before I died. It was like the need for a wake up whiskey after a two day bender. How to shut off the fuel feeds? Move, Max. My vision was going. Shut it down. I shut down one engine, but it didn't make much difference. second I got out of there. I needed one more gulp of fresh air before I died. It was like the need for a wake-up whiskey after a two-day bender. How to shut off the fuel feeds. I shut down one engine, but it didn't make much difference. Back to smelling like suntan oil, stale margaritas, and greed. second I got out of there. I needed one more gulp of fresh air before I died. It was like the need